the first step of a 10 meter circle continued on a straight line. By the same token, if you can do a 10 meter circle, you can do haunches in. Come back on these little circles uh, that you were on before, but go in the other direction. You can do haunches in because all haunches in is, is the last step of a 10 meter circle continued on a straight line. And by the same token, in the way that we looked at the hindquarters to see if the horse was truly bending, so you guys walk on a 10 meter circle and then halt on the last step of the 10 meter circle. If we look at half of the horse's body, in this case, the front end, so you're gonna halt on the last step of the 10 meter circle to do haunches in, good. <laughs> Okay, excellent. All right, so, <laughs> she's doing a hoochie coach here. Okay, so, if we look at the horse's front end, and all I could see was, was from the saddle forward, I couldn't see the saddle, I couldn't see behind the saddle, I would not have enough information to know whether these horses were just walking or trotting straight down the track, or if they were in haunches in, because the position of the front end should be identical to the position you have when the horse is going straight. Now, I don't know how well you can see the fence here, but are those shoulders and front feet parallel to the rail? No. Okay. How about you, Alicia? Are the front feet pointed toward the rail or are they pointed straight down the track of the stallion? Yeah, they're pointed a little bit to the right. That, that's a good mistake down there, um, Allison. You can, well, now you semi-fixed it. Go back to Mav. 